A few years ago, if a picture were made in New York, Chicago, Pomona, or anywhere but Hollywood, nobody would look at it. Europe, of course, didn't even exist. I think it was uh, World War II that brought it to our attention. But today, even though we like to think of Hollywood as the film capital of the world, we know that motion pictures is an international art, and we respect the merits of any picture, no matter where it was made or in what language. To introduce the award for the best foreign language film of the year, we go to Paris for the international star and two-time Academy Award winner for Gaslight and Anastasia, Miss Ingrid Bergman. <laughs> In the recognition of the fine film work done throughout the world, the Academy presents its Foreign Language Film Award. In countries all over the world, organizations similar to the Academy are charged with the task of selecting their outstanding pictures. And then these are sent to Hollywood and viewed by all the members of the Academy. And five pictures are nominated for the Foreign Language Film Award. The president to the Academy, Mr. Wendell Curry, will announce these five pictures so honored and present the Oscar to the winner. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Wendell Curry. May I say first that uh, this award I'm most proud and happy to be able to present. Nominated as the best foreign language film of 1962. Electra, Michael Kokiana's production from Greece. The Four Days of Naples, the Tannis Metro from Italy. Keeper of Promises, the given word, Sinadistri from Brazil. Sundays in Cybele, Roman Pines, production from France. Tlayucan, Daxionis Matuk from Mexico. The winner, please, Bill. The winner is France for Sundays in Sibir. Well, I must say I'm very proud, especially on behalf of my crew, my actress, Hardy Kruger, Nicole Courcel, little Patricia Godzi and my producers, Mr. Roman Pines and his partners. And, well, what else could I say? Um, thank you very, very much. And I say merci beaucoup. Oh, yes, one more thing. Maybe the next title of my film will be Monday and Oscar, after Sunday and Sibel. 